Um, in November 2022, so just last year, a uh, position became available to have a social worker in both the emergency room departments at Bracebridge and Huntsville. Mm -hmm. I jumped on the opportunity, honestly. I feel like it was a, a good opportunity to be able to see people um, when they're in crisis in a quick way mm -hmm. um, and try to help them figure out what their next steps are. We all know when people are in crisis, they're really not sure where to go, right? Mm -hmm. um, and I think having a social worker to really come in and say, I'm here and I'm going to guide you um, is, is really beneficial. So Desiree has been a key player for our emergency department and our mental health patients. She's been supporting our department with uh, mental health crisis in the moment, so it's very timely. Mm -hmm. Our patients uh, have a decreased length of stay, and then she's navigating the discharge component of that as well and really tying them to our community resources mm -hmm. if we can get them back home safely. I think that it benefits patients because they get to see somebody quickly. So mm -hmm. I am a trained clinician. I am practiced in most uh, cognitive behavioral, dialectical behavioral therapy, solution focused. So I can help somebody solve a problem that they're experiencing right away. Um, and then I can help them get to their next steps. So it just means it's going to happen faster. Mm -hmm. um, it's not going to clog up emergency departments. Um, and then we can figure out what their best steps of next care is. We've seen an influx, influx of mental health since um, COVID-19. Mm -hmm. Obviously, that's weighed on uh, the vast majority of the population's mindset um, and has had an impact on someone or their family member. So uh, really, we, noticed, we identified that this is an area of concern mm -hmm. and something that we want to move forward and really strive to achieve and excel on in our emergency de departments because uh, most of the people that come in are in crisis and mm -hmm. seeking help. Um, and really just having that help ready and available for them when they need it.